yes, I think that um, the, the organisation, well, politically, I, I'd love I'd love us to be actually developing our education systems in a very different way than they than are at the moment. Um, I think there's much too much emphasis on um, standards and, uh, and and results, and and and, and not enough. Uh, emphasis on taking a step back and saying, what's the purpose of education? What are we trying to create? And, 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 and let's actually um, you know, think of ways that we can actually build, um, you know, create a, a, you know, a, a better educated workforce for, for the next generation. Um, obviously, you know, the, the generation is, is doing their own thing and, uh, and learning um, outside of the school system, because they're all, you know, the millennials and and, uh, and, and, the, and the generation after the millennials are all growing up you know, digitally native and growing up connected, and and they're learning a hell of a lot outside of their uh, of, of the standard school system. So I think the education is going to be disrupted in the next ten years, in in the way that any other um, kind of type of organisation is is going to be disrupted. So 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 this is going to change and uh, you know change. Dramatically. Dramatic in ten years, um, whether the politicians want it to or not. Um, but yeah, I, I, I agree with you. It, it, it's it's down to the organisation to facilitate and, and, and educate um, and, and, and allow for the, the sort of um, idea generation and, 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 and growth um, in a, in a way that organisations ten and twenty years ago wouldn't have even thought of. Mm. 